Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Please remember to take what resonates and don't manifest the rest. Queen of Wands jumping out there. Let's see what's going on here. What's coming towards my Pisces? Queen of Wands. Three of Swords is the challenge. So, past heartbreak over the Two of Cups is the challenge here. So, I do feel like, Pisces, you have been very, very disappointed in the past when it comes to your Two of Cups, when it comes to love. I feel like somebody, somebody really, really did you dirty here. Queen of Swords is the most recent recent past. That's cutting out the nonsense. Somebody is not interested in the shuang shuang. They want love. They want real connection, real love. Otherwise, they don't want to be bothered. What's in the immediate future? Immediate future. I said, Pisces, you have definitely um, taken your earned your stripes, so to speak. Seven of Cups in the immediate future, Seven of Swords, and the Knight of Swords. So, I feel like somebody. Okay. So, this person's going to come in say lots of pretty things and offer you the world but they're going to deliver you the seven of swords and 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 you pisces i think you already know who this person is and what they want it could be two of them knight of swords and knight of wands somebody who's very reckless with their behavior Somebody who cares more about the swing swing and the passion than they do about love. And you're going to find out. I, I feel like you're going to already know with the seven of cups here what's in those cups. Absolutely nothing. It's a mirage. You're going to find out that somebody lied to you too. What's new? I mean, for real. What's new? It's not, it's not, and it's not Pisces like you know when somebody's lying to you. You know. And we got another seven coming here. And, and somebody's been blocked. Maybe you got this person on block. This Knight of Cups. It's justice. Because whatever you were feeling here, it's true. And and you're going to find that out in the immediate future. Maybe within the next few weeks. Outside influence. The hermit. Mm -mm -mm. Virgo energy. Outside influence. If somebody's now stuck in their head, having to heal. Because whatever... Oh... They're in a fight because of you. I feel like this person found out something about you that they should have known a long time ago. And now they're finding it out and they're stuck in their head. They can't, they can't seem to move because of this four of wands. But whatever they were dealing with, it's over. And they're sitting there thinking about you. Virgo energy. Hopes and fears. Hopes and fears. Justice. Five of Swords. Nine of Pentacles. Pisces.
This person wants to help you fight for justice because you've done something all on your own here. You fought the good fight. You got your own justice no matter what happened here. And uh, they want to come in and help you be self-sufficient. What is the final outcome, Spirit? What is the final outcome? I don't know why, but I'm getting real irritated. It's like somebody held up something that belonged to you for a long time. Long time. The world card something coming back around to be revisited could have something to do with what you work on or what what you do for work um, and some kind of legal situation you may have to sign some paperwork something that has to do with your work seven of pentacles six of cups and the Eight of Pentacles. This could be something you did in the past. Gemini energy, Libra energy, Ten of Pentacles. So Pisces, you may you may have an inheritance coming. Some kind of inheritance. Perhaps it's what you do for work. Maybe it's something that has been stifled in you your whole life. Yeah, okay. So, we had a tempter here. Somebody who came in and, and, and tempted you with money, with pretty things, with, with luxury. Could be a Leo, could be a Sag. But I feel like your judgment was made here, Pisces. That there was more to life than just being a queen of wands. You, in fact, I think you put that down. It's like... Like all growing up, you know, I thought I was going to be a rock star and that kind of thing. But I don't think that anymore. Because... I've put that down. I've accepted who I am and what I'm here to do. Strength is definitely going to be needed when you make this judgment call because this judgment is going to affect more than you. It's going to affect a whole group of people, possibly your family. I will say, Pisces, don't hold on to grudges. Because I feel like whatever this heartbreak is that's coming in, it's going to set you free. It's going to let you know that everything you've done in this life hasn't been in vain. Six of Pentacles, Six of Cups. Past money, past It was owed to you. It was owed to you. And it's going to make you very happy, but at the same time, it, it's going to break your heart to think that, that these people put you in an illusion, possibly your whole life. Leo energy. Two of Cups, King of Pentacles. Sorry, guys. That just kind of hit home a little bit. You're somebody else's two of cups, Pisces. It doesn't mean that they're yours. Okay? Um, and I do know how it feels to want what you want and not settle for whatever this is. Trust me, I do. And 
you keep going no matter what. All right? Because this person tried to present you with something that was basically an illusion or an option. They tried to buy your love. And I, I believe that that's, that's the part that hurts. Is that, you know... They didn't come in just to be a, a, a good Samaritan. They came in to try to sway you in their direction so you wouldn't see something past an illusion. Queen of Swords, Death, could be a Scorpio, could be a Leo. You let go. Four cups to the Queen of Swords. You not only let go, you cut a bitch. Because you wasn't having it. It's like, I see you. Do you not understand? I see you. Like I said, I'm getting irritated. What is the Seven of Cups in the immediate future? What is this lie or this option? Judgment. The Devil and the Nine of Wands. This person is going to try to not leave you with any other options, Pisces. They are obsessed and hurt because I feel like you did cut a bitch here. You knew better. You knew better. You knew it was a lie. And you knew this person was obsessed with you in some way, shape, or form. This reading just got a little creepy. Um, yeah, don't stalk me. Don't. I mean, it, if you want to watch me, watch me all day long. But don't pretend you're something you're not and try to pop up in my life. Because that's what I feel like is going on here. Just because you want me doesn't mean I want you. Somebody tried to make you tap into your, your sacral here and, and, and go with your south node, your passion, your your um, sexuality. They tried, they tried really, really hard, Pisces. Because they thought you was good looking. But there's another feminine here. Somebody's getting justice. And it ain't you. This person's trying to bring something back from the dead, Pisces. But I think it's a trick. Make sure you know your own energy here. Because whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, they want to see you done. They want whatever you have. They want whatever you're offering to the world. They want your spark. Whatever it is that you're offering to others as a light. They want to take your light. So they're going to offer you some kind of a, a seven of cups to just take it just, yeah. If you got nothing else to look forward to, you might as well take this. Well, fuck that. I got, I got me. And I'll take me over something I don't want any day. And if I can't kiss you, it ain't happening. I mean, if I can't look at you with some kind of endearment and want to be with you, it ain't gonna happen. Plain and simple. Like I said, ugh. Five of Wands, the Emperor, and the Queen of Pentacles, they're in cahoots with each other. Very much wanting to compete with you.
I do feel like these people are, are, are really trying to smear your name. Trying to smear your name in the mud. And that's where they want you to pick up your crown chakra from. If you pick it up at all. Unreal. People are unbelievable. Like I said, this this Queen of Pentacles, whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, she is obsessed. Obsessed. With your gifts, with what she wants, and not what you want. She's going to offer you some kind of chunk change here to settle for with a masculine. So you don't get your true blessing, whatever that might be. We will find out. This has something to do with what you do for a living too, Pisces. Uh, they want you to take, not see, their obsession. They want you to take this four of pentacles like you don't have any choice. Because you're waiting on something. Like you're waiting on something. All the time. Like perpetual waiting. Like perpetual waiting for something to happen. Perpetual waiting for... Uh, you know, this to come in. Working your ass off till you're tired. But you, I, I do feel like, Pisces, you have surpassed whatever this is to the point where now you're standing on your own two feet and you just plain don't give a fuck. Hopes and fears here, Pisces. Got the hermit again and justice. I feel like these people are observing you. In some way, shape, or form. Whether that be online. Or whether they... Um, and that they're trying to make it a point. To make you feel like you're not good enough. It's, it's it, this is like a a um a get even campaign maybe because you turned down somebody's cup a smear and a get even campaign but what goes around comes around and there's the world card you put a stop to it you put an end to it in the most recent past and, and it hurt you. It hurt you that somebody would actually go to these lengths to push you. Final outcome is a choice. A choice to be foolish or a choice of a brand new beginning. You're supposed to travel here, Pisces. You're supposed to be your own boss. You're supposed to have a life that maybe was taken from you and something else was given to you that wasn't that wasn't what what was supposed to happen you've had a lot of people messing with your life for a long time maybe since childhood maybe since childhood and th and that's what's that's what's heartbreaking about this is that somebody went out of their way, could be a father, went out of their way to make sure that you lived in the life of a seven of cups instead of an ace of cups. Always wondering if love would ever truly find you. Or you would truly find love. Because I, I feel like love finds you all the time. It's just that you're not willing to settle for... Settle. And this person's coming towards you, Pisces. Final outcome is the Six of Swords and the Three of Swords. Somebody wants to fix something here. They want to help you with your pain. The King of Pentacles. You're about to receive a message from this person. 
they want back in your energy Pisces because they know that you're fixing it you may be fixing it to have a wheel of fortune because you mag magically delicious but they're only seeing the top surface of this they're not seeing what they've done to hurt you they're only seeing the surface of this they stopped a union from happening they stopped something from happening they're still trying to stop it so they're coming in to ask you to marry them settle for them whatever the case may be and it, you know and I'm hearing is that all is, is this all I got to choose from Oh, ball-headed men with no fucking future. Sorry. <laughs> that was a personal gig there. You're not going to be happy about this. I'm just going to be for real with you. You're not going to be happy about this. And to find out that, you know, you've been chased into your hidey hole here by people who wanted to see you fail. People who wanted to make sure that they took you down a notch and you didn't get what you want I'm going to I'm going to clarify the 7 of cups in this judgment card What is this about spirit what is this about because I want to know I want to know who's coming in to lie to me to try to bring something back from the dead that's a lie And like I said, that final outcome uh, tells me a lot. Yeah. So, Pisces. Ace of Cups to the High... To, not High Priestess, the Empress. Somebody's going to try to make you make a choice. Ace of Cups, Ace of Wands, Two of Wands. No choice is a choice. Just going to be for real with you. And and if all they're offering is a seven of cups, you better use your better judgment here. Because it's, it's, it's bullshit. Somebody just wants to swing swing with you. And, 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 you know, I'd like to say... The Ace of Cups is here. New Love is here. and But I can't get around that Seven of Swords and that Seven of Cups. This person made you an option in the past. And it hurt. Now they're all of a sudden going to come in and say, Oh, well, I want to make up for lost time. Pisces choose wisely. That's all I'm going to say. You know? Because I do feel like there's a whole bunch of lies behind this. It might be a new beginning in love, but there is a seven of swords behind it. Seven of cups behind it. You're going to get this empress energy anyway. You're a mom or you're... You're dealing with a mom or, or something like that. Somebody who does love you unconditionally. What is this Queen of Wands and the Seven of Wands about? Yeah. So somebody thinks they're entitled here, Pisces. They think they're the, they, you're, you're their perfect match. and You're their perfect match. and I'm your perfect match. Um. Huh. So... This person is going to come towards you. They're going to offer to work with you. They're going to offer some kind of a, a deal. To bring something back from the dead. And it could just be your Empress energy. Perhaps you gave up on love. But this person is painting some kind of illusion. To make you believe in them. It ain't going to be what you thought it was, Pisces. I'm good looking, you're good looking, so let's be good looking together. 
Sometimes it ain't all about looks. You get down to the real real here. <clears throat> there she is. That Queen of Pentacles and the Hierophant. This is somebody who knows your fortune. They, they know what you got coming here. And they want to win at all costs. Could be a Taurus. Somebody that could do the same thing that you do for a living. They know what you got coming and they're competing with you to try to take it from you. They're getting help. You're not. With that five of wands on the hermit here, this is somebody who, who keeps chasing you back into your, your seclusion, keeps chasing you back, making you feel like you're in fear of any of, of, of accepting any kind of offers because there's a five of wands, seven of swords, and a seven of cups behind it. We're getting about tired of this game. You take your winning at all costs and you stick it. Pisces done had enough of this Three of Swords. Alright? Five of Pentacles, Three of Swords. Pisces is sticking up for themselves now. And you can go get bent. Because you ain't taking shit. Pisces, you could have a hard time trusting anybody right now because of these games that people play. And they, they push a narrative on you that doesn't belong to you. It's not, it's not your trajectory. You have a specific relationship coming in. And these people are trying to step in the way of that. They think they're entitled to your energy and to whatever you got coming. Which is the Ace of Cups and the, and the Empress. So they're going to lie, cheat, steal, do whatever they can to block your progress. They've been doing it the whole time. Ever since you were you were a little kid. They've been doing it the whole time. I'm feeling secret society here with the Justice of the Hermit a couple times. These are people who hide behind the scenes because they're slimy. Slimy. You gonna hang out and get your justice. And they're confused as to why you already know. You already know. And you're stronger than they ever gave you credit for. These people have tried to manipulate your energy on my guess is, is your whole life. Leading you in different directions. Stopping your progress. Whenever you started getting ahead, getting in the way. Trying to make you settle for some kind of whatever, whatever. Eight of Cups is the final outcome here, Pisces. Two of Cups, Queen of Cups. This is not what you want. And you're going to walk away. You want what you want, period, point blank. You're not going to settle for less. The Queen of Cups is a sweetheart, and whoever these people are, they have gone out of their way to fuck up your life. And now they think they're just going to come in and say, I want to marry you. You're my person. And Pisces says, eh, wrong answer. Not what I was looking for. I'm going to go here. I'm looking for this. Equally attracted, equally in love, equally two cups full. And if it ain't what I want, I'm going to go the other way. If it ain't this, I'm going the other way. Somebody's coming in to try to lie to you, Pisces, and I, I hate that for you. I hate that. Seriously. 
you've worked so hard so hard somebody wants to take away your pain Pisces third party interference attraction flirting dating hooking up stalker ascending third party they don't want you to ascend Pisces to a higher vibe they want you they want you to stay on the ground and be bitter in that in that Queen of Swords energy. Can't say you're not bitter, but it's 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 not even bitter, it's better. You're better. Yeah. They want to stop your transformation, Pisces. You're getting ready to go through a huge transformation by focusing on yourself, self worth, and your shadow work, your self appreciation. And this is what they want to stop is your ascension, your Phoenix moment, your transformation. Because they're stalking you, hiding behind a mask. This is like the Wizard of Oz thing, where you pull back the curtain, and he's like, I see you. I see you. All your masks have fallen off. And I see you. Camera. Snake in reverse. You're shutting these people down, Pisces. You're shutting them down. They're not, they're not able to do this anymore. And I think they know that. Because you're not gonna, you're not gonna settle for, you know, whatever this is, because I feel like it's an illusion. It's, it's some kind of a, a, a trick. Well, you stop it with the tricks already. Pisces sees you and Pisces is tired. Tired. See Beacon Fairy guidance, but where will it lead you? So you do have guidance here, Pisces. Where you take it from here is probably going to be up to you with the power of three. You see clearly clairvoyance, and it's time to be brave. A wonderful idea, an aha moment, and holding on way too tight. So... Somebody wants to take your ideas. They want to take your your ideas, your your hot empress energy. They want to they want to stop you from progressing in life. And they feel like if they come in and make some kind of cheesy offer here and then take it away, they're going to stop that. They don't understand that pain fuels you. Pain fuels your fire. The only reason why you have come this far is because the pain that they've already put in your life has triggered something in you to make you keep reaching. And I do feel like you see you see whatever this is coming in clearly. There is guidance here Pisces, but where is it going to lead you? Whose guidance is it? Is it this stalker that doesn't want to see you transform? Or is it your own? Make sure that you know what belongs to you here as far as your energy goes. It's really important that you do so. I didn't plan on going this far with this reading, but, you know, it is what it is. Falling. The unknown. Descent. Momentum and change. Yeah. So, this is... They're trying to descend you while you're trying to ascend you. Investigate. Do your due diligence here, Pisces, because there's something you need to know. Look closely. Ask questions. Think before you act. Absolutely. Growing up, wanting to... Wanting to grow and experience rejection of perpetual youth. 
So they want you to reject your inner child, Pisces. Do not do things that are bad for you. Don't drink the Kool-Aid here, Pisces, because somebody is really trying to get you to drink the Kool-Aid. Almost have prizes, trying to please everyone. And this is a people-pleasing energy. So Pisces, be aware of your people-pleasing skills because this is somebody who knows that you like to make people happy. And they're gonna they're they're gonna play on that. They're gonna play on on your desire to make other people happy. Make you happy, Pisces. You got something on you that's very very valuable, and if it wasn't valuable, there wouldn't be so many people trying to take it from you. Because I do feel like like there's a whole family here, at least five people trying to take your gift. Exactly. This person was expecting you to take this. Because maybe you're not doing so hot in, in, in finances. But you have a gift here, Pisces. And a journey that needs to be taken. Perhaps you don't have the kind of money that it takes to go on that journey. And, and you want to. But that's about to change. And these people know it. They're trying to stop you. I keep seeing the number 17. I don't know why. Probably because it adds up to 8, which is luck, which is fame, money, all that stuff. These people are really, really trying to keep you in lack and poverty mindset. So you do not discover who you are in whatever this is, this scheme of things. And you've got somebody coming in that's really going to try you. Really going to try your patience, Pisces. Could even be a mom. My mom is not here no more. You're forgiven, whoever you are. Just get out of my energy and let me get on with my life. I sometimes wonder if it isn't too late for me to apologize don't care thoughts and visions of you and me together never leave my mind obsess much eh. I always get so emotional when I see your beautiful face well I have no idea who you are so I can't say it's the same thing And even if I didn't know, if I know who you are, then it's a big fat no. <laughs> it's a big fat no. Live your life with both feet in Pisces and com commit fully to being here on this planet right now because you've got something to offer here. Someone is in need of your lo love, offer it to them. You can have my love, but you can't have my soul. Stay present. That's where life happens. Exactly. You just stay in the present, Pisces, because whatever's coming towards you is, is something you really don't want. Someone you really don't want. Especially, like I said, if there's anybody in your past, you're not you're not up for the you're not up for it. Security thriving and enlightenment you are definitely you have some kind of potential here that is out of this world and I do mean out of this world Pisces and that's what they're trying to get you to stop doing or stop bringing into into fruition here if you if you settle for any old cut and they feel like they got you and they could stop you from progressing, to, from thriving, from your own security and your own potential. Like I said, I'm about sick of these motherfuckers. And they wonder why you're in the Queen of Swords energy. Heh, <laughs> well, it's because Pisces has this clairvoyance and this intuition. It sees you coming. It tries to prey on 
Pisces weaknesses and Pisces is sitting there going is this all there is really because they expected much more from relationships or, or much more from love in general <laughs> it reminds me of one of my viewers Manny he says, he says I'm sick of these great value girls I want, I want some name brand shit <laughs> I can so relate okay so mother of life when life seems dry depleted filled with repetitive tax tasks or sex yeah stagnant or stifled and stifled Isis the mother of life holds the ability to revive even the most numb resistant and difficult circumstances in your life she calls to you now seeking to bestow gifts of life upon you be bold and brave you did have the brave card come out too and open your arms to receive the, the they're trying to stop this for, from coming towards you, Pisces. This is some kind of a, a gift that you already possess that's, that's trying to come to you. And these people know it. They know it. And they're competing with you. They're trying to get you to stop what you're doing and go run off with somebody that, that says pretty things, does nice things, gives you money, takes care of you. So you don't realize your full potential here the brother in darkness whenever negative energy is present it's a sign that we are ready to move more deeply into our feminine divine power you shall overcome any negative energy with grace and triumph stay in your heart there is no need to be afraid do not fear what you can't see Pisces Go with the knowing that you have of what's right for you and not what's right for everybody else. Do not people please here. Just because somebody does something nice for you doesn't mean you're obligated to do something for that person in return. All right? Wow. Well, those are your messages, my baby sharks. Please remember to press the like button, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye for now.